Hey, it's Chris Widener. I want to talk to you about the fourth point of my book, Live the Life You've Always Dreamed Of. You know, we all have this life that we want to live, and uh, some people live their dreams and some people don't. And, uh, and I want to help you live your dreams. I'm living my dreams. I live in a house that I drove by for 21 years. I used to stop in front of the gates and I'd look beyond the gates at the house and I'd say, I'm going to buy that house someday. Um, I've been married for 24 years. One of my goals is to be married 60 years in my life. Well on my way to that. I've got four great children. Um, I, I live my dream life. When I was a teenager, I bought a book called uh, Put Your Money Where Your Mouth Is, How to Make a Living as a Public Speaker, and that's what I do for a living now. I'm living my dream life. I'm no smarter than you. I'm no better than you. Uh, but I have learned a few things along the way, and I want to share those with you. Why some people succeed and other people don't. Point number four in my book, Live the Life You've Always Dreamed Of, is that the tenacious bird gets the worm. You know, we've always heard the early bird gets the worm. I believe the tenacious bird gets the worm. One of my favorite quotes uh, that, that I've made up, and I, I say it in all my speeches, and I, I just drill it home to people all the time, is that the difference between the successful and the unsuccessful is not the absence of obstacles, but the presence of perseverance or tenacity. It's not the absence of obstacles, like, oh, that person succeeded because they didn't have any obstacles. No, everybody has obstacles. The difference isn't the absence of obstacles, but the presence of perseverance, the presence of tenacity, the presence of the ability to keep going and keep going and keep going, the ability, the, the, the uh, innate desire, the determination, the dedication to go even when the obstacles exist, even when they present themselves, the successful people, the people who live their dreams are the people who are tenacious. They go and they go and they go and they go and they go. They get knocked down, they get back up, and they go and they go and they go and they go. They suffer a setback and they get back up and they go and they go and they go. The question is, is are you somebody who's going to go and go and go? Are you tenacious? I'm convinced that oftentimes the successful are simply the people who outlast the unsuccessful because we all get knocked down. I can tell you story after story after story of ways that I've been knocked down in my life. But the one thing that I do do is I get up and I keep going and going and going and going. The question I'm going to ask you today is, do you go and go and go and go? Or do you quit? A lot of good people quit. A lot of good people just give up. A lot of good people say, well, you know, I tried. But if you really have a dream that you want to live, go for it. And when you get knocked down, get back up and go for it again. Because you really have to be tenacious if you want to get your dream. If you want to live the life you've always dreamed of, you have to be tenacious to go get it. Because life is hard. Life's going to hand you setbacks. Life's going to hand you obstacles. Life's going to hand you problems. You know, Jesus said, in this life, you'll have trouble. That's about as true as it gets. There's trouble in this world. But successful people are the people who are tenacious. They don't let the setbacks, they don't let the obstacles, they don't let the hardships affect them. They go and they go and they go and they go. So you might be facing a hardship right now. You might be facing something that's knocked you down on your butt. My question is, are you going to get back up? Are you going to go for it again? Are you going to double down? Are you going to triple down? Are you going to recommit yourself? Because that's what successful people do. Successful people are tenacious. And in their tenacity and their perseverance, they end up being able to live the life that they've always dreamed of.